So the idea is, here's the idea. So I was watching some radio hosts like Opie and Anthony or Howard Stern. It wasn't those guys, but it was something like that. And I noticed that there was the mainstream voice and the quirky co-host. And when I saw the contrast between the mainstream businessy voice and the quirky alternate alt voice on the same show, I was kind of surprised because I had thought that I would make a good uh, alternate voice or quirky co-host to Tim Cast. And uh, so that's sort of the topic. And the thing that I, that I ended up thinking about was when at Occupy Wall Street, they finally allowed me to facilitate a general assembly. Now, when you facilitate a general assembly, you need to have a facilitation team that you kind of lead. So the facilitator has two people, someone that keeps stack and someone that um, takes all the notes. And the notes aren't like regular notes. The notes are like basically like exactly what everyone says. The notes is like what you accomplish. So that everyone's at the General Assembly that is on the list to speak, that everything they say gets written down because decisions are being made. And I would often get frustrated with how they would how they would facilitate the General Assembly because it would it would be frustrating and it'd be very long and people would argue and very little would get it done. And I would say, you know, it doesn't have to be that way. And they'd be like, yeah, yeah, you don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah, you know. Yeah, everyone's an armchair critic. Everyone's a backseat driver or whatever. That sentiment, they would send in my direction. And of course, I would believe them because gaslighting, that's what gaslighting does, is it convinces you that, that you're wrong even when you're on point. But when they did allow me to facilitate... Of course, I got my team together and I had the meeting beforehand and we prepped and surpri surprisingly to all of us that when I facilitated the General Assembly, that I was very competent, that I wasn't kind of competent, I was really, I was really good at it. Or I was like above average, which was way above average. So even though I was only above average at, gener at facilitating a General Assembly, Compared to the other people who supposedly had training doing it, I was, I was really good at it. But you wouldn't say that it was really good because it was just above average. And then afterwards, people would come up to me and they'd be like, wow, you know, wow, we're so surprised that you could, they would, they would tell me how surprised they were that I could facilitate a general assembly and that I could facilitate a general assembly with some skill. And... I would always, when they would tell me, oh, wow, hey, we're all surprised that you really could do that, I would be like, that's really rude that you say that. That's, that's, that's more, it's, it's really rude, and I, I feel bad that you're surprised.